that we've been intercepting these signals for the past six months. We still don't know their origin, but our analysts have concluded that they are encrypted orders for sleeper agents operating inside this country. Just the sort of thing Mr. Hoover has been warning about. Soviet operatives have penetrated the very highest levels of our military and government. It is a fact. The NSA is not convinced that this is a Soviet operation. Director Falk, is this gonna devolve into another one of your outsider briefings? Well, there's been a new development. A device was recently recovered from the Illyrium mine in Bannock, Montana. The technology is unknown to us, but suggests the activity of a far more sophisticated organization. And where is this device? Close. Send Agent Carter down. <laughs> Agent Carter. Who wants to know? Your escort. Director's orders. I don't need an escort. Well, you're getting one. How much have you been told? My orders are to deliver that case to Director Falk. That is all. And you haven't even been the least bit curious to what's inside? Uh, no. Good. But I'll have to make sure. No one touches that case except Director Falk and me. We'll see about that. It's here. This is it.
stop and take the shot. You've done it a hundred times. Keep moving. <clears throat> Agent Carter, I'm Agent Nils. Director Falk ordered me to- Falk? Is he still alive? Last I heard. Grab that two-way over there and try to reach him. Director Falk, come in. This is Carter. This is Agent Kinney. The director and I are defending the sub-level lab. Do you have an escape route? We're maintaining position until you and Nils report for evac. Right. I'm on my way. Get to the Advanced Materials Warehouse and take the elevator to the sub-level. We'll hold here as long as we can. Come on, we can cut through here. Door. I'll meet you inside. All right. I gotta get that door open. Sorry, soldier. I need this more than you do. A squad commander lives and dies by their choices on the battlefield. Charging into combat only gets a brave soldier shot. If a commander wants to achieve victory over superior forces, they must be observant, creative, and precise. Keep quiet. They're here. Get in position behind those crates. I'll flash them from the window. Opening fire! Nowhere to hide, you bastards! Open fire! Die! Die! That's it. Let's keep moving. That got him. Let's meet up by the door on the other side. Nice shot. You're good, Carter. I used to be. Bullshit. Falk wouldn't be interested in you if you weren't the best. We'll see. Nothing we can do for him. Poor bastard. Cover and position will keep your agents safe and opens the enemy to attack. You can cue actions for your agents, such as moving to a position and firing on an exposed enemy. Watch for opportunities and make every shot count. The battlefield can be your ally if you use it well. Eat lead! Watch out! They got some kind of machine gun nest! Hold on, I've got an idea. Get 
behind that! Going now! Finish it off! Set up crossfire. What are these little bastards? We'll figure it out after they're dead. supposed to explode. Let's not stick around to find out. Freight elevator's in here. Watch out, Carter. They're here. Great. Should I take them out? <laughs> Open fire! God damn, they're dug in! Keep moving. Hit that button. The elevator will take us down to Director Falk. Come on, come on. Jesus! You see you hear that? They're outside. Grab some cover. Where do you want me, Carter? Hills, go, go! Let's head down. Those taller ones. They're different. I think they're giving the orders. The others are just grunts. Jesus. Let's get out of here. Come on, let's go. How do we know Director Falk is still alive? The old man's tough as nails. And he's got Kinney and Weaver to watch his back. Yeah, but who says they can be trusted? They've been with us since the beginning. If anyone's loyal to Falk, it's those two. What the hell are those? Jesus! Poor bastard. We never stood a chance. We've got to reach Director Falk before they do. Loyalty's got nothing to do with it. Just before the attack, one of our people turned on me. One of ours? I think she was 
infected with something. Her eyes turned black. She shot me and went after the case I was carrying. She shot you? Yeah. I don't know what happened after that. Whatever was in that case, it killed her. And it saved my goddamn life. So where do we find Falk? The Illyrium lab is just ahead. And what's Illyrium? I don't think you're cleared for that. I don't think it matters anymore. Right. Well... We found it a couple of years ago. It didn't take long to figure out that it's an extraterrestrial element. Some sort of space rock. Can't be a coincidence that these outsiders attacked the only Illyrium lab on Earth. Stop! Stand down, soldier. Agent Nils, good to see you alive. Agent Carter, we need to talk. That's right. William Carter, Agent Second Class CIA, reporting is ordered. Now, can I get some answers? You had an artifact to deliver. Do you have it? It was destroyed in the fighting, sir. I'd be dead if it hadn't somehow healed my wounds. Interesting. When we get out of here, my team will want to do some tests. Sir, with respect, my assignment here is temporary. Under the circumstances, I should report immediately to Director Frost. We have to assume that the Director of Central Intelligence is dead. Sorry, Carter, but the protocols are clear. You work for me now. I can't just be here. Uncertain. There's been a nationwide communications blackout. I'm working under the assumption that Washington has been hit. My god. For now, we have to assume the worst. Do we know anything about these things? We've theorized about these outsiders for some time. But this is our first confirmed contact. And it's gone just great. We were hoping to learn more from that artifact you lost. But now, we've got no shortage of material to study. I just want to know one thing. How to get rid of them. You and me both, Carter. Why did they attack us? We've got a lot of theories, but no answers. Maybe they're from the moon, and they don't want us coming there first. This is hardly the time for jokes, Agent Carter. We can't stay here. First we evacuate this facility, then we'll figure out how to strike back. Getting out of here is gonna be tough. I've got to finish securing the research here. Without it, we won't have a chance. You, Nils, and Agent Kinney, collect the commanders in the war room and lead them to the rail platform. Understood. Agent Carter, good to meet you. Save it until we're out of here, Agent. Kenny, what happened to Agent Weaver? She headed towards the war room a little while ago. No word if she made it. She'll turn up. She always does. Down there, in the lab. What are they doing? Don't know, don't care. Get into position while they're distracted. Yes, sir. In position. <clears throat> Open fire! Got that spot all stitched up! Stay there! 
Let's move on. I see why Falk wants you for the Bureau, Carter. That's what I told him. Let's not find out. Just get to the war room, collect the brass, and get out. If any of them are left to collect. AJ! Enemies dug in! More artillery. We shouldn't feel it this far underground. They're here! <clears throat> That's it. Let's keep moving. Damn. What were they doing with the Illyrium down here? Everything. Reactors, munitions, all kinds of stuff. Some of the things I saw, it was just like out of one of the old Captain Thunderclap serials. This must put out as much juice as the Hoover Dam. Jesus. Those walls were supposed to withstand a nuclear blast. Let's get out before the whole place comes down. Equal! We gotta get in there and help! God damn it. with the Illyrium. Yeah, nuclear bombs. Bigger than any nuke we have now. Way bigger. Building down here. Weapons fabrication. No end to the things Illyrium could do there. Anything we can use? Not unless you want to carry a bomb. The war room is this way. They're digging? Why? What are they doing? This place is coming down. We gotta get the hell out of here. First we save the brass, then we evac. 
The war room is just ahead. What happened in here? Nothing good. Move. General Deems, are you all right, sir? Where's Fog? What happened here? I'll ask the question, son. Yes, sir. Director Falk is at the rail platform. Our orders are to escort you there immediately. Then lead the way. Uh, ah! General! Clear the target, now! <laughs> That's not Deems! He's one of them! Nils, get back! Just hang on, sir. It's gonna be... Oh. Okay! Why did you stop me? What the hell were you thinking? I was thinking that I just saved your life. You ambushed a four-star general. How do you expect me to react? They can control us. They get inside you and they control you. Deems is dead, and we don't have time to waste. What happened to the rest of the leadership? They were dead when I got here. I thought Agent Weaver was sent here to guard them. I am Agent Weaver. Angela Weaver. And that infected bastard was already here when the fighting started. One of their puppets attacked me earlier. What's causing this? I'm not sure, but obviously it's connected to this attack. We've been tracking cases like this for years. Deems was one of our top brass. How did he come under their control without anybody realizing? As far as we know, there's no way of telling who might be susceptible to their control. If they got to Deems, they could get to any of us. You knew that he killed Hoover and the others. You could have taken him out earlier. I was going to, but he was resisting their control. He might have been able to fight it off. I shot him to stop him from killing the three of you. We have to get out of here. Falk ordered us to bring any survivors to the rail platform. The diesel will only get you as far as the test site. Can we radio for evac from there? We're nearly out of time. Get to the rail platform and head out to the test site. I'll call in a Sky Ranger, collect Falk, and meet you there. If you can't reach the test site, we'll have no choice but to leave without you. General Deems. I can't believe this. All of them. Dead. Who's in command now? Falk is. And until we hear otherwise, we assume that he's in charge. For all we know, he's the president. You really think they got... Jesus, what is that? Some kind of power source. Like those reactors back there. Those weren't bombs they were launching into the ground? No, I think they have other plans. What does it do? Uh Keep moving. Open fire! Moving over there. There it is. The rail platform. Oh, shit! Outsiders on the rail platform! Carter, what do we do? We go through them. Ready your weapons. Let's get out of here before this whole place comes apart. This will take us to the test site. What are we waiting for? Made it. Too fucking close. Carter, this is Falk. We are en route. Take the diesel to the test site and signal us when you arrive. I didn't like that. Hold on to something! Look at that thing!
Should be a radio up there. I just hope they haven't left yet. Come on, Carter. Radio in and let's get out of here. Falk, Agent Weaver, anyone? Copy, Agent Carter. Sky Ranger 1 reads you. I've got Falk and Weaver, and I am inbound to your location. I don't like the look of that bomb up there. Would you rather head back to the base? Should be fine, as long as we don't start any tests. Right? Here they come! Visual attack! They got that area locked down! They're down below! Let us know where you want us, Carter! Seeing enemy forces inbound to you. These fuckers aren't gonna stop. Sky Ranger, how fast can you clear the test site's blast radius? Blast radius? Carter, what are you? I'm gonna start the test sequence. It's the only way to keep them from following us. And get some payback. Carter. He's right, sir. Sky Ranger's built for speed, but it's no match for those outsider ships. All right, do it. Good. Let's give those bastards something to remember. Listen, we're not safe and we're sure as hell not done fighting. Do exactly what I say, and we'll get through this. Yes, sir. We're with you, Agent Carter. Sky Ranger to Carter. Agent Carter, respond. 
This is Carter. Cutting it close, aren't you? We're coming in. Get on board. 